So with that, my last question is, tell us a little bit about your favorite piece of retro technology that not only makes you smile, but was it something that helped you put you on the path that you're on today? Especially if we're talking about putting me on the path that we're on today, that you still see good retro um, presentations around, I'd have to say video games, actually. <laughs> um, when I was growing up back in the 80s, like video games were, you know, were pretty new things. And, um, you know, when you see both retro games being implemented, whether you're doing kind of pixel graphics and, and uh, you know, 8 and 16 bit uh, graphical displays and, you know, kind of the uh, synthesizer music and stuff like that, whether it's that or like an old video game that's been brought back or even older games from the 90s, PC games that have been ported up to the to modern architectures. Um, I, you know, they definitely put a smile on my face. And the thing about them is that when I was a younger man, I really, really, really wanted to get into writing video games. I thought that was going to be my thing. And, uh, you know, along the way, I uh, strayed into cybersecurity and it kind of, you know, once once you get in, getting, getting out is, uh, is hard to do. 